There are some foods in our diet that we can eat to help with mental retardation and further loss of intelligence. Basically, what is bad about staying in the body is not stored well in the brain. It is confusing that there is no escape from these foods in our lives. But remember that there is a key to living a healthy life in moderation. If we manage the balance between healthy and unhealthy foods, we will definitely be allowed to enjoy the occasional fun. The first one is alcohol. We are certainly not surprised by the reputation of alcohol as our brain killer. We are often aware of the devastating effects of alcohol on our liver, but alcohol can also cause serious damage to brain cells. Known side effects of alcohol include memory loss and lack of concentration. Subscribe our YouTube channel to watch the rest of this video and more. Long-term alcohol abuse also causes cognitive impairment. Second group are junk foods. Burgers, fries, and the like tempt us, but eating this food causes us to accumulate fat. Unlimited consumption of this type of food prevents the production of dopamine, which is the chemical happiness in our body, and causes symptoms associated with depression. Third group are sugar-rich foods. Stored sugars cause nerve problems. Excessive consumption of sugar leads to a decrease in the production of a chemical in the brain, the absence of which impairs learning as well as memory. The addictive nature of sugar has long-term consequences. It affects learning ability and impairs cognitive skills. The next harmful food are fried foods. They are known in the southeastern United States as the stroke bill. High levels of fat and cholesterol in fried foods build up in the walls of the blood supply to the brain. Insufficient blood supply eventually leads to a stroke. Therefore, when your diet regularly includes fried foods, you are more likely to have trouble. The fifth group are frozen meals. Most people are forced to freeze their food because of the little time they have in their lives. Eating frozen foods on a regular basis can increase the risk of Alzheimer's disease and also lead to dementia, which is the destruction of brain cells over time. The next group that are very well known are salty food products. Salty foods like sugary foods can be addictive and have dangerous consequences. Sodium is known to cause changes in blood pressure, but the point is did you know that it can also impair our thinking abilities? Salt is used as preservative in pickles, so do not eat too much. The next ones are processed proteins. Proteins become dangerous when they are processed into sausages and peppers. Preservatives such as sodium nitrate can be very carcinogenic when combined with proteins in meat processing. What do you know about nicotine? Nicotine is known to cause cancer when consumed in large amounts due to reduced blood supply and oxygen to the brain. In addition, hardening of the capillaries and affecting the function of neurotransmitters and the transfer of chemicals in the body are other side effects. Next group are artificial sweeteners. Many of us have a misconception that artificial sweeteners are harmless in our lives. The use of this group can eventually lead to brain damage. The last group are trans fats. Trans fats are found in confectionery oils, solid vegetable oils, margarines, sweets, snacks, fried foods such as dumplings and fried potatoes, and other foods cooked or fried in hydrogenated oils. Consumption of trans fats increases the risk of coronary heart disease. Over a period of time, we experience the pain of a sensitive stroke. Also, consuming this type of fat reduces the volume of the brain, which eventually leads to Alzheimer's disease.